Hi everyone, my name is Katie, part of the Gamer Katie's channel, and today's walkthrough will be to the moon. So let's begin. It is a indie game that is supposedly very fun and will make you ball your eyes out, and I am quite the well, screamer and crier and all this other stuff. So let's try it. I do like this music, it's fun. It's pretty. I'm wondering where we are going. Actually, it sounds like waves. Wonder if they went out there with a the recorder and boombox. Let's get the waves. I wish I could play piano like that. Uh oh. What was that? crashes he doesn't she jumped over the boulder where were you looking Neil well excuse me for heroically evading that squirrel coming out of nowhere you ran it over anyways <laughs> that would be me my friend oh you ran it over and hit a tree don't worry it's a company car are you kidding me? The boss is going to kill us. I know my boss would kill me. Hmm, well, it, we'll just say I was saving a puppy. He likes puppies, right? He's more of a cat person. Figures. Why does the world have to be so complicated? Fine, whatever furball he fancies, crisis averted. Good, go write that on your report later. <laughs> Let's grab the equipment from the car and move already. Oh, left click an object to interact with it. Received equipment. Got the sucker, let's roll. Uh, right click to toggle menu or cancel. Okay. Oops. Can I type? Oh, no, okay. Equipment, characters. We can save. Oh, let's save here. Will be file two. How do I escape out of this one? Escape. Oh yeah, that worked. Let's go straight up. Hey, wait! Don't forget the car. Just wanted to see if you remember. Yeah, let's uh, lock the car that has been ran into a tree. Why the heck not? Birds and oh, look, stick. Just stick. Oh, I can't get it to stick. There's a bird. Let's go up here. Who put a boulder here? Maybe it's their security system. <laughs> cucumbers. We don't have any time for this fluff. Oh, God. I'm going to start saying that. Cucumbers. Let's try pushing it out of the way. Maybe we could find a tree branch to jack it with. Wait. Or we could just call it a night and blame it on that. I want to see what happens if you abort mission and go home. You do know that we won't be paid if we go through with this, right? Hmm, I do need to find an Ikea shopping spree soon. Oh god. Ikea. Let's find a branch. Oh, branch. Yay, we got the branch anyway. Let's go back up here and let's puck it with a stick. Because you know that moves boulders, right? was that? Uh, I don't even... <laughs> you and me both. It's some kind of air ball. So it was a volleyball. Uh, right. We need to get going for now. Right. I understand those controls. I am working here. Uh, okay. Two squirrels chasing each other. That seems legitimate. Pretty up here. Guess we probably should go inside. Be professional like. Ma, they're here. <coughs> I'm 
gonna try to do all the people in different voices for her now on out. Not a bad place to retire at, huh? <clears throat> I could do better. Night shifts. Love them or hate them. You know the answer, you stupid owl. It's probably gonna be another all nighter, you know. I know. And I doubt they'll have any coffee. Shut up. And the ocean waves will sing lullabies. Not through your blathering, they won't. And your others will. Let's go inside. Don't forget the equipment, moron. I don't get paid enough for this. I'm too old for this stuff. Act 1. I never told anyone, but I always thought they were lighthouses. Dr. Watson, Dr. Rosaline, I presume. Thanks for coming on such short notice. That's okay, I tend to be bad at predicting deaths as well. Are you the patient's daughter? Oh no, I am just a caretaker. And these are my children, Sarah and Tommy. It's not exactly a 9 to 5 job, so Johnny lets us live here. I suppose this Johnny is our man? Johnny? Listen, if it's a kid we're dealing with, I don't think we're the ones you want. Wrong voice, I apologize. No, no, he just prefers to be called that. He's upstairs right now with his medical doctor. Come with me. Come on, grab the case and let's go. I love her. She's just like, gung-ho. When my back breaks one day, I'll see you with the insurance claim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Received equipment. Again. <laughs> Alright, let's head upstairs before I drop this. That would hurt. I drop things on my feet so many times. I'm like horrible. I'm the biggest klutz in the world. Okay, they're gone. Whoever gets there first gets to play the melody. I have no idea who said what. Aww. No fair, you pushed me. Did not. Whatever. You get the boring two notes anyway. So wish I could play piano like that. That is amazing. Those kids are pretty good for their age. Hey, you're the one who said there was no time to waste. And incidentally, I'm the one who is carrying the weight of a small meteoroid. Yeah, yeah, come on. I'm guessing straight in here. <laughs> Go and run room. You can't even hear the music anymore. I'm guessing we talked to Lily. Ready to set up? Let's look around first. Gee, you know, I think I'd like to carry this excruciatingly heavy object around some more. Thanks for asking, though. Of course, we'd have a sarcastic Dr. Watts. <coughs> he's unresponsive at this point, but by the looks of things, he's still consciously, consciously hanging on. It's hard to say how long you have, but I would hurry. And can't talk to Johnny. I guess. Let's, oh, it's not here. Can we look down here? Oh yeah, we can. Okay, let's go this way. 
You two, let's go back up here. I guess let's get started. No, stop. Ready to set up? Set machine down? Yes, it'll just be a moment. Written by Ken J.O. Are you sure a common household power outlet is sufficient? No worries, we're the experts. Power outage. <laughs> oh crap. Standard procedures, just keeping you on your toes. That is an interesting machine. How's he doing? Not so well. If I were to say, he's got just a day or two left. That's plenty of time. So you two can grant him any wish, huh? To try at least. But we always succeed because we're awesome! So, what's the wish? The moon. The moon? The moon. He wants to go to the moon. The geezers, geezers just keep getting on crazier, huh? So, can you do it? It depends. She meant to say yes. Why don't you tell us about our client here? That... I don't really know much. Johnny is an odd man. Though... The two years that I worked here, he really spoke. Spoke. He really spoke. He really spoke. He worked as a craftsman for most of his life, and his wife passed away two years ago. I don't really know many details. I would have known more if I were his paper boy for Pete's sake. Shh, just do your thing. Well, I suppose if you look around the house, you may find some more info. I suppose Johnny wouldn't mind since he signed for you too. Hmm, so be it. All right, which one of us plays detective? Oh, let's do Rosaline. Thanks for the offer, but I'm busy leaving a butt print on this chair. Right. Do continue. Tommy and Sarah can show you around. They're probably at the piano downstairs. Okay. Oh, first things first. Let's do a save here. Okay, that worked. And let's go downstairs. Wait, come back here for a moment. Sure. I have something for you. Ooh. Let's just actually walk straight over there. Here, take this. Remote patient monitor. That will keep you updated on Johnny's status. Thanks! I was just going to ask for it. Activate it in the menu. Oh, look, right there. Bottom. 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 Bottom, 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 and we're just going to exit out of this before I annoy you guys. There we go. Now let's go downstairs. Unless we get stopped again. What you want? Sure. 
coming around. Sarah and Tommy, right? Your mother said to ask you two to show me around the house. Okay, maybe we will. Maybe. I think we just need a little convincing, that's all. <laughs> what do you think, Tommy? Yeah! Uh, what would you like? We want one trillion dollars! Or the candy cane mom hides from us? Yeah, or that! Oh my god, these kids are gonna be such a sugar rush. Huh? There is a giant candy cane on top of the high shelf that we can't reach. It's in the kitchen! Mom put it there to save for us when we do chores. I love how it's in the kitchen. Get it for us and we'll give you a quick tour through the house. What do you say? Well... If it makes it easier, I'll just do sure. My mother used to keep handies on high shelves too. Alright, I'll go get it. The kitchen door is right next to the stairs. Now, go. Well, that was rude. And you know what? I feel like going through this door. This probably isn't the kitchen. You never know though. There's dining room right there. It's the bathroom! Just gonna go through and destroy the entire house. No, go back. I meant to turn on the light for peak's sake. Yes. Scan the bookshelf. You guys can pause and read this. I'm not reading this out loud. Or you won't do nothing. Let's not do anything. Rash here. Let's get through. And let's get through here. There's the candy cane. Keep getting it. I don't think that's gonna work. Maybe we should see if we can drag something. Oh, here we go. Telekinesis! That was freaking awesome, dude. Let's telekinesize this bitch. I received a candy cane. Terrible time calories. <laughs> oh god. Can we turn the sink? No, we can't. Okay. Can we turn that one? No. Turn the light? No, let's just go. It's not really that hard to get down from there. Really? You're just gonna get me out of kind of trouble, aren't you? There we go. I guess let's go give it to the brats. I mean, let's go give it to the kids. Okay, I got what you wanted. A good old candy cane. Even though it's not Christmas. If you come and give me a tour of this instant, I won't seize on it. Okay, where do we start? I know there's this funny room in the basement. And I don't like that funny room. What do you mean by funny room? You'll see. It's weird. We need to get the keys though. The old man hid it inside a book in the study. And guys, that is where we're going to end tonight. Thank you for watching, and leave a like, a comment, and a subscribe if you feel like it. I prefer if you guys do. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks for playing.